years now, Donald Trump has been president, and you can feel it across this country. There's a lot of, a lot of folks out there who are afraid, and the danger is real. Right now, in 2020, our democracy hangs in the balance. We have a decision to make. You have a decision to make. And that is, what do we do with this? Does the fear make us pull back? Does the fear make us cower? Or are we a people who fight back? Me, I'm fighting back. That's why I'm in this. I'm fighting back, and I'll tell you what. Fighting back is an act of patriotism. We built this nation by fighting back against a king. We saved this nation by fighting back against the scourge of slavery. We rebuilt the economy of this nation by fighting back against the Great Depression. And we protected this nation by fighting back against fascism. That is when Americans are at their best when they take on the big battles and when they fight back for their country and their families. This is not a time for small ideas. This is not a time for campaigns that look back. This is not a time for us to run vague campaigns that nibble around the edges of the real problems that we face. I am not running a campaign that was designed by a bunch of consultants. I am not running a campaign with proposals that have been carefully moderated not to offend big donors. I passed that stop sign a long time ago. I'm running a campaign from a lifetime of fighting for working families. I am running a campaign from the heart because I believe that this is our moment in history. I believe in what we can do together. I believe in the America that we can build, an America where everyone has value, an America where we invest in every single child, an America where people, not money, are the most important part of our democracy. And if you believe in that America, and you think that America is worth fighting for, then I'm asking you today, commit to caucus for me. Get in this fight. Go to ElizabethWarren.com, sign up, volunteer an hour, put in five bucks, because here's the thing, you've got to get in this fight. This moment in history will not come our way again. You, right here in Iowa, are going to determine the direction of this country not for the next four years or the next eight years, but for generations to come. I am in this fight because this is our moment in history, our moment to choose hope over fear, our moment to dream big and fight hard, our moment to win.